Retired workers of Osho State Government have held a series of protests in Oshogbo, the state capital, to demand payment of their gratuity and pension. According to the pensioners, the problem started after the introduction of contributory pension scheme, which forced many workers to leave the service. Some of the affected retirees who spoke behind camera lamented that they were denied their benefits after serving the state for years. Some said they are sick and in pitiable condition as well as unable to feed and buy drugs. A retiree, Remy Adeagbo Alabelewe, appealed to the state government to fast track the process so that the money can be paid to the pensioners. Currently, the situation with the contributed pensioners in Osho State, without minding the years they have entered the palaver, is, is, is worrisome, is that study, and people are dying every day. People are on the sick bed. We uh, want to urge the governor, uh, to please assist and fast track the payment of the contributed pensioners uh, uh, entitlement vis a vis the 29 uh, month have uh, 29 and a half month salary. Other pensioners, Richard Akintade and Lai Laoyi, who retired before contributed pension scheme was introduced in the state, said they received their gratuity and they are getting their monthly pension. Pensions and gratuity were adequately and instantly paid. Maximum of three months, you get everything. But by the time I retired, it was getting a little bit not as easy as it was. But fortunately, I was able to collect my own gratuity and got myself enrolled for monthly pension with, uh, with some ease. But that has not been the luck of those who retired after, especially those who retired after 2012. I retired from the Ocean State Civil Service in 1997 from the Ocean State Ministry of uh, Information. And uh, since that time, I've collected my gratuity. And since then, I've been collecting my monthly pensions till date. But it's like things have changed now. Because some uh, workers that uh, retired currently, they don't get their money on time. Contributive pension was introduced by the Obasanjo administration to address myriads of problems associated with pension administration in the country.